hello everyone welcome to unify study so here in this video i am going to share with you some good top pyqs of cg set i am showing you question and answer one by one if you were able to do that if you are able to solve it then after doing it you can just leave the class and you can go ahead with your next preparation but if you are not able to understand then you have to watch the complete video to understand the concept this cg set question is not only required for the chatisgarh candidate this is required for all the students those who are preparing for any computer science exam ugc net exam set exam phd entrance hsst exam or trb exam whatever exam it is but the questions are very very good quality questions i will explain each and every question one by one so let's start and if you are new to this channel then definitely subscribe to the channel click the bell icon to get all the latest update and notification and to learn more and with less is more strategy because i will give you good quality question always so here you can see what is the output for the c++ programming this is how it is working here these are variables there are four variables x1 that is 49 x2 store 48 x3 150 x4 50 these are the four variables now it is an array pointer type array means this array will hold the address of another variable in this array how many things 1 2 3 4 0 1 2 3 these are the location now each and every location is holding the address of another variable x1 this is holding the address of x1 this will hold the address of x2 this will hold the address of x3 this is holding the address of x4 now what i am doing here i am trying to print star arr what is the meaning here here star arr star a3 so in a3 position what i am storing this one 50 star a3 means the value of a3 that is 50 minus a1 what is here that is 48 48 so it is ultimately star a r r 2 what is this is 2 this is star a r r 2 where what is the value here this is x3 150 that's why your answer is 150 very good question right and within less time you are able to understand everything i hope so how it is working this is the value this is the value actually this is not your address it is the value whenever you are using star with the pointer means you are taking the value and here outside another star means it is from that array in that index location what is the value that i have to find out very good question on pointer i hope it is clear so ek like to kar do chalo ha agar aapko soch raha hai ki mam hindi mein kyun nahi batate hai mam hindi mein nahi batate hu kyunki bahut sara student ko hindi mein problem hai yaar english mein hi adjust kar lo chalo here which write down the recurrence relation c mart short C mart short here it is C mart short not only mart short list of n integers C is the number of sub problem normally we know that t n by 2 plus order of n and here we are writing how many times right here what it is a t n by b plus f n a is the number how many times you are doing and this is the size of the sub problem this is number of sub problem this is size of sub problem so in mart short size of sub problem is n by 2 number of sub problem is given c that's why it is ct number of sub problem is given here c that's why it is ct so your answer will be ct this one c t n by 2 then order of n n by 2 not n by c because size of the sub problem will be also n by c normally we are doing n by 2 n by 2 will be not because it is given that c 
C is your number of sub problem and the size of sub problem will be also C. Normally we are doing T n by 2 but it is not it is C mark short that is why it is your answer. Very good question. Now this question is here you can see that list of unshorted element this is given you have to do bubble short and this is not given in ascending or descending anything but the problem is that you have to do in descending order because the ascending order the options are given in descending order after third pass first of all elimination you can apply because i know that after first pass i will get the largest element in the first one so 54 then in the next largest one element that is 47 then the next largest element that is 23. So after third pass this three element will be my sequence. So this is not my answer. This is not my answer. I can eliminate. But the problem is that both are same. Now what is my answer? So for that I have to execute the program without execution you can't do here. So let's execute it how it is working. 10, 47, 12. 54 19 23 i will go from this side because i have to do in descending order how the bubble shot is working it is checking the adjacent element and if it is greater than then i will switch so here i can see 23 is greater than 19 so 23 will come here 19 go there now 23 and 54 no swapping 54 and 12 there will be swapping 54 will go there and 12 is coming here now after that between 54 and 47 there will be again swapping 54 and 47 now again 10 and 54 there will be swapping so ultimately 54 will come here and 10 this is the result after fast pass after first pass you will get this result after first pass i am getting this result i have to run the second pass again so after first pass 54 comma 10 comma 47 comma 12 comma 23 comma 19 this is after first pass now i have to run the second pass from the same way there is no change no swapping here i have to do swapping 23 and 12 19 as it is now uh, 47 and 23 here i have to no swapping because 47 is here only 47 and 10 i have to do swapping here 47 will come here 10 now there is no swapping so ultimately after second pass you are getting 23 12 19 this is after second pass now i have to run third pass same way i have to go with this 19 12 is there any swapping yes because 19 is greater so 19 then 12 after the 19 and 23 no swapping 23 as it is 23 and 10 there will be swapping so 23 10 is here now after that 23 and no no swapping so 47 as it is 54 as it is finally you are getting 54 47 23 10 19 and 12 this is the sequence you are getting here right so you can see 54 47 23 10 19 12 that is the answer you can see here this will be the correct answer time left way now here you can see this one the logical configuration of the shift register consists of the chain for the flip flop connected with in cascade here it is in cascade the flip flop connected as next flip flop which one is true actually the statements are given for shift register you have to do shift register how the shift register is working this is called shift register where ultimately we are shifting the bit from one bit to another bit shifting is going on it is using one clock pulse only and just bit shifting is going on nothing else so if you come to the option 
all flip flop are not connected is this not connected to another one this is wrong it is connected output of one flip flop is complement no directly no complement you can see here there is no complement directly we are doing so there is no complement it is given complemented that's why this is wrong this is also wrong now you see in the next one here the third one this is wrong third one each flip flop having the separate clock pulse no just now you saw that here they are using same clock pulse right all flip flops receive the common clock pulse and cause the shift from one stage to next stage this is correct one so answer is this one right now see with the question only so many so means in a small time in a less time you are getting more that is very very important now you can see maybe it is hiding behind me this is i hope now it will be visible this is all the statement given according to three address instruction what is three address instruction three address instruction means there is two source one destination at a time you are using two source one destination that is called three address instruction now question is which one is false here question is here which one is false three address code defined by the instruction of a equal to b op so here is the operation op code b is one variable d is another variable so here a b c is the address and op is op code is of the binary operation actually here it is not d here it is c will be there a b and c means after operate operand there is c i think some print, printing mistake may be there so it is at a time as mixing three variable two source one destination this is true three address code defined by conditional jump here you can see the conditional jump that this one if a then operation then b go to l this is also three address at a time i am using so this is also true three address instruction code here index operation here a is one variable b is another variable i is another variable which is holding the address uh, means it is just like an array from a array you are taking in in proper index so you are using three variable again three address at a time it's required so this is also true so it was the question is which one is false any of them is not false none of the above is the correct answer very important three address instruction now you can see this question the er model express in terms of easy question but still when i was taking class in paid course then so many student did mistake how i am recording this video you know in the paid course we are doing lots of question like uh, maybe we solve 80 question 100 question out of those some specific question where students are stuck where students are getting mis doing mistake and i saw that yes these are the good quality question those questions only i am uploading here so you are getting here 10 question what is shorted area means what is already i have shorted and this is the good questions i am uploading if you want to learn in detail all these 80 to 100 question every day whatever we are practicing so many question then definitely you can go to our paid course you can visit unifystudy.com that is our website from that website you can purchase our paid course with very less price you can avail the paid course so go for it you can install unify study app and you can definitely go for it so here er diagram model you can see er diagram most of the student was doing mistake with the functional relationship here not at all it is er means entity relationship so here is entity here is relationship and each and every entities are attached with attributes are entity these are the focus not the functional so that's why option 4 is not correct here this question is also very good question dash ensure that no more than the allocated number of people are allocated in given so what is the maximum number of people will be required to do this software uh, schedule so that is effort so that's why your effort validation this is effort validation now the next question which of the following not a general characteristics of artificial neural network a in in artificial neural network in artificial neural network fast processor is not the focus 
learning is the focus robustness is the focus parallel processing is the focus but this is not the focus of artificial neural network because why we are doing artificial neural network so that machine can work as a human brain that is the focus fast processor is not the focus here in virtual memory even such program which have a larger size than the main memory are allowed this is means you know but you will be confused with the option so virtual memory means what if i have a program of 100 kb but my main memory size is 80 kb normally i am not able to execute here but with the virtual memory concept we are able to execute where the processor size process size is more than my main memory size with the virtual memory we are able to execute it so that is executed so answer is executed here not this very good question here also you can see another question during the operation of the data query which files are used i saw that most of the student did mistake dml query language option is focusing on file which are the file you are using these are language no not focus in language files data dictionary and transaction log these are the files question is focusing on the file you have to focus in the keyword of the question so it is the answer so i hope you will like this class right i hope this video is helpful for you within less time you learned so many concept stay tuned with me and let me know in the comment section like share and subscribe share this video to all of your friends and try to increase unify study family more and if you are giving me support then definitely i will upload more videos here and cg set candidate aapka pyar milega to chatisgarh mein bhi unify study rock तो ये आपका रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी है अगर आपका मेरा सपोर्ट जरूरी है तो आप मुझे भी सपोर्ट करो थैंक यू बाय सी यू सुन इन माय नेक्स्ट वीडियो बाय बाय